This is Angel May Abuhat Cafe from BS Ed Math 1 and today we will going to have an instructional video that focuses the muscular strength and muscular endurance. Muscular strength is the amount of force you can put out or the amount of weight you can lift. While the muscular endurance is how many times you can move that weight without getting exhausted or very tired. So these exercises will begin in 3, 2, 1. The plank exercise can be used as the basis for the core muscle strength and stability test. The plank is more of a strength building exercise than a cardio exercise, but by engaging a range of muscle, it can also help to boost your calorie burn. Step 1. Begin in the plank position. Face down with your forearms and toes on the floor. Your elbows are directly under your shoulders and your forearms are facing forward. Your head is relaxed and you should be looking at the floor. Step 2. Engage your abdominal muscles. Drawing your navel toward your spine. Keep your torso straight and rigid your body in a straight line from your ears to your toes with no sagging or bending. This is the neutral spine position. Ensure your shoulders are down, not creeping up toward your ears. Your heels should be over the balls of your feet. Third, hold this position for 10 seconds. Release the floor. Lastly, overtime work up to 30, 45, or 60 seconds. Squats burn calories and might help you lose weight. They are also lower your chances of injuring your knees and ankles. As you exercise, the movement strengthens your tendons, bone, ligaments around the leg muscles. First, you need to stand with your feet a little wider than hip width, toes facing front. Second, drive your hips back, bending at the knees and ankles and pressing your knees slightly open. As you sit into the squat position, while still keeping your heels and toes on the ground, chest up and shoulders back. Lastly, strive to eventually reach parallel, meaning knees are bent to a 90 degree ankle. Press into your heels and strengthen legs to return to a standing upright position.
Steel climb exercise is great for building cardio endurance, core, strength, and agility. You work several different muscles groups with mountain climbers. It also or it almost like getting a total body workout with just one exercise. Lunges increase muscle mass to build up strength and tone your body, especially your core, butt, and legs. Improving your appearance isn't the main benefit of your shaping up your body, as you'll also improve your posture and range of motion. First, you need to stand with your feet hip width apart. Second, step forward and bend your both knees, lowering until your knees are bent at a 90 degree angle. Third, shift forward onto the lead leg. Lastly, push off on both legs and step through, lifting your back leg and bringing it forward as your rear foot lands ahead of you in a lunge position.
sit exercise activates muscle groups throughout your lower body, including your quadriceps, glutes, hamstrings, and calves. Wall seats can increase your muscular endurance. First, engage your abdominal muscles and slowly slide your back down the wall until your tights are parallel to the ground. Adjust your feet so your knees are directly above your ankles or rather than over your toes. Keep your back flat against the wall. And lastly, hold the position for 20 to 60 seconds.